Hello and welcome back to another computer sluggish tutorial. So today we're going to take a look at removing any malware that could be on your system. So this could be all sorts of things. Your computer could be a bit slow which means that you could be infected by malware or you could have constant adverts keep popping up on your system and all over your web browser. You have spyware so someone could be spying on your system and get your passwords or any information that you type into your computer. So a very good program that I like to use to run checks is called Malwarebytes. So if you head on over to malwarebytes.org, the link is in the description. And at the very top here, hover over for home and then select Malwarebytes Anti-Malware Free. Right, so now you end up on a page that looks like this. And we're just going to quite simply press free download. Okay. So just wait for the .exe to pop up so we can press save file. So there it is. So save file, just saving the setup now. So if I go back to that page quick and you can see here. So malware bytes, it's a scanner that detects and removes malware like worms, trojans, rootkits, rogues, spyware and more. So obviously as you can see very good program it tries to detect anything that could be on your system. So now the programs downloaded we're going to up top right hand corner here select the .exe to run the setup. So we're now going to go OK to English and we're going to go next, I accept, next, 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 and next, and install. Quite long winded. Right, so I don't want to enable the free trial, so just want to launch now. So we're going to go finish. And as you can see, straight away, so just remove that. Right, so straight away, as you can see, it's checking for updates. So make sure we've got the latest database, database version. So I'm going to go update. Oh, okay, so it's checking again. Nope. So no updates. So we've got the latest version, as you can see. So if you want real time protection, obviously you've got to upgrade to premium. And we're using the free version, as you can see there, free. So I'm now going to go on here fix now so as you can see a scan has never been run on your system okay so actually let's go up top here you can go scan so here we got recommended so just for a threat scan so you can do a custom scan there or you can do a hyper scan but that's premium only so we've only got the free version anyway so we're now going to go threat scan and we're going to go start scan so let's see if we have any malware on our PC. So just let it do its thing. I will fast forward the video now to the end of the scan. Okay, so two seconds. Okay, so now the scan's complete. At the bottom down there, as you can see, it says scan complete, non malware detected. Okay, so that's always good news. So, <clears throat> on our main window here, it's got potentially unwanted program. So, that's actually in my recycle bin anyway. So, I don't want that anyway. So, when I empty my recycle bin, it would have got deleted anyway. But for now, just show you what this screen looks like. So, it's where all your threats that gets detected will be listed. And over here, you can obviously check which one you want to delete. So I'm going to remove that now. So just simply click remove selected. But normally the case is if there's anything in here, you do want to remove it because it potentially is going to be something that's not good for your PC and could be causing you problems. So just go remove selected now. And so it's been successfully removed. So my computer needs to be restarted now to complete the removal process. So would you like to restart now? I'm going to go no because I don't want to lose my recording that I'm doing right now. But you would go yes. 
I hope this tutorial helped. Remember to hit that like button and subscribe for more tutorials.